did their experience with amateur boxing in Canada and in Ontario. Um, because we have a lot of youth who are a little bit lost, you know, they're looking in different directions um, for boxing. And, and I wanted to give us your take on that. Um, I mean, we're well, right now, like I said, everyone knew that all the, all the amateur stuff has died down. But um, I say years when I was actually um, on the amateur team and all that there stuff, I mean, I think that we had a, a very good uh, program and um, some, some very good athletes that came out of Canada at the times. Um, but I don't, I don't know. I think a lot of stuff has changed now. Um, I, I don't, I, I can't really, I don't know. It, it, it's hard to say. Um, but it's, it's, it's not much that I'm seeing too, right, right, right now in Canada. I don't know if it's, um, like I said, um, everyone just jumping, going uh, the pro route without even having to get that amateur background type of stuff. Uh, I don't know if that's what it is, but it's like it's not the, 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 the young guys nowadays, they ain't really seem like they're worrying about building, getting the amateur background and all that, their foundation right now. So I, I don't know. Yeah, what we've what we've also seen too, we've seen a lot of Canadian fighters fighting for other countries now because for whatever yeah. reason, you know, they're not. But that's getting, what I mean. I've seen a couple getting, of them. Um, they, the they, they go they go to um, other countries as well, and I don't know if it's if the stuff on the the um, the Canadian team changed now. Like I said, I ain't been there for a long time now, so I mean, right. maybe stuff changed. Yeah. Maybe it's not what it used to be. I I really don't know. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful.